If you like our video, click the subscribe button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses and training materials, visit us at teachucomp.com. You can export list data to an IIF file, which saves it in a text format for transfer to another company file or to other applications that can use IIF files. You can also import IIF file data into company files. However, Intuit doesn't provide assisted technical support for importing and exporting IIF files, so you may want to choose another method unless you are very comfortable with importing and exporting data. To create an IIF export file, select File, Utilities, Export, Lists to IIF Files from the menu bar. In the next screen, choose which lists to export to the IIF file format. Then click the OK button to continue and open the export dialog box. Select the folder to which to save the export file and what to name it. Then click the Save button to save the IIF file with the information from the selected lists. To import an existing IIF file into an opened QuickBooks company file, select File, Utilities, Import, IIF Files from the menu bar. For versions of QuickBooks Desktop Pro before 2019, then select the IIF file to import in the dialog box that opens and double-click the IIF file to import its data. If using QuickBooks Desktop Pro 2019 or later, however, an Import IIF File window opens instead. The import process has been improved starting with the 2019 release to prevent users from importing corrupted data. If using this version, then click the Import IIF button in the Import IIF File window to open a dialog box where you can then find and double-click the IIF file to import. If you successfully import the IIF file, a window opens and shows the number of imported items. If not, then a different window opens instead and shows the number of items imported and not imported. You can click the Review Now button in this window to find and correct the errors in your IIF file. Then save the file and select Yes if asked to keep the file type. Then close the window and re-import the corrected IIF file. Remember to click the subscribe button to see more of our videos. Get ad-free courses at teachucomp.com.